if you're not careful and you no clip out of reality in the wrong areas, you will end up in the back rooms, where it's nothing but the stink of old, moist carpet, the madness of mono yellow, the endless background noise of fluorescent lights at maximum humbuzz, and approximately 600 million square miles of randomly segmented empty rooms to be trapped in. God save you if you hear something wandering around nearby, because it sure as hell has heard you. Level 1. Habitable Zone. Survival Difficulty. Class 1. Safe. Secure. Minimal Entity Count. Description. Level 1 is a large, sprawling warehouse that features concrete floors and walls, exposed rebar, and a low-hanging fog with no discernible source. The fog often coalesces into condensation, forming puddles on the floor in inconsistent areas. Unlike Level 0, this level possesses a consistent supply of water and electricity, which allows indefinite habitation by wanderers, providing that appropriate precautions are taken. It is also far more expansive, possessing staircases, elevators, isolated rooms, and hallways. Crates of supplies appear and disappear randomly within the level, often containing a mixture of vital items, food, almond water, batteries, tarps, weaponry, clothing, medical supplies, and nonsensical objects, assorted car parts, boxes of crayons, used syringes, partially burned paper, live mice, mice in a catatonic state that have been injected with unknown substances, shoelaces, loose change, bundles of human hair. The crates should be approached with caution due to their contents, but are a valuable resource. In addition, crude paintings and drawings with no apparent origin or meaning appear on the walls and floors. They are known to change in appearance and disappear when not in direct line of sight or when unlit. The light fixtures within level 1 are prone to flicker and fail at inconsistent intervals. When this occurs, supplies are liable to vanish inexplicably and hostile entities may appear unexpectedly. These entities rarely attack in groups and tend to avoid light and large gatherings of people. It is advised to carry a reliable light source and sleep holding whatever items you do not wish to lose. Level 1 is home to the hub. Bases, outposts, and communities. MEG, Major Explorer Group, Base Alpha. This is the first main base of the MEG. About half of the group's teams live here, mainly housing explorers and supply outposts shared with the BNTG. The base is close to one of the entrances of Level 1, heavily guarded against threats such as entity attacks. BNTG Trader's Keep Trader's Keep is a large, city-like complex. Around 412 inhabitants, non-hostile, possesses rudimentary societal infrastructure, a main supply hub for wanderers. Trader's Vault is set up in the storage hall in Level 1, keeps communications and friendly relations with the MEG. Tom's Diner, run by Tom, a former chef before no clipping into the back rooms, has plenty of food and storage, resupplied by the BNTG every few months. Tom is an amiable and optimistic person, and his diner serves as a small social hub. Entrances and Exits Entrances Get here from level 0 by no clipping. This level has many entrances. Opening ordinary doors in many levels has a good chance of leading to level 1. Additionally, climbing one of the trees in level 11.1, .1, the end of the fifth event in level 92, and completing the King's Trial in level 94 are all reliable ways of returning to level 1. Exits you can leave level 1 by simply continuing to explore the back rooms. Wandering down any extended hallway often leads to level 2. Finding holes in the wall will lead you to level 19. 
where the ceiling has paintings on it. No clip through, and you will be at a party. Additional material. Recovered documents. The following notes have been recovered from various locations in level 1. No apparent source has been found. The artist lives in me. The artist dies in me. Won't you stay for the after party? Smile. Burn my fucking body. The bluebird beckons you, soothes you. You feel safe here. Black Queen to H5 and that's checkmate. Watch the clock. The final prophecy draws near.